The chosen cast members have always been open about what it's like to play such important historical personalities. But did they ever talk about their own dating lives and relationships? Even though we always see these actors on screen, their personal lives are a complete mystery to most of us. That's going to change today. Are you ready to talk about the real-life partners of the chosen cast? Let's dive in immediately. Well, of course, I'll start with Jonathan Rumi. He does play Jesus, so he should take precedence. When it comes to Rumi's dating life, there's a lot of misinformation on the internet. If you search for Jonathan Rumi's wife or partner, you get these photos pop up on your search engine. And in every news story about Jonathan's personal life, the woman in these photos is presented as his wife, but you'll learn the truth today. This woman is a singer, actress, and director, Maria Wargo, who worked with Jonathan on a project. Maria and Jonathan co-produced and co-directed a live performance about the Passion of Christ. The performance was The Last Days, The Passion and Death of Jesus. You can find the trailer for the performance on YouTube. Of course, Jonathan played Jesus again in this production and Maria played the Virgin Mary. Since the two were busy promoting their project, the internet was filled with their photos and videos. That's why many people probably mistook Maria for Jonathan's wife. But they are not married. They're only work friends. Also, Maria is the president of GK Chesterton Entertainment, a nonprofit organization that produced the last day's play. Believe it or not, Jonathan is the company's vice president, so that's another reason why he's seen with Maria Wargo all the time. There are also rumors around the internet about Jonathan being married to a woman named Hannah, but Jonathan denies the rumors. He's currently not married. Since he doesn't share much about his personal life on social media, I don't know if he's dating anyone. After talking about Jonathan Rumi, I'll move on to your favorite disciples from the show. Let's start with Matthew first. As you may already know, Matthew was portrayed by an incredible young actor, Paris Patel. When you do a web search for Patel, you cannot find anything related to a girlfriend or a partner. He usually shares selfies or pictures from his projects, but doesn't let anything on about his personal life. I tried to search for clues, but I could find nothing. It seems he's lonely or does not share anything about his private life on social media. What about Simon, you might ask? The most handsome of all the disciples in the show, at least to me. Sahar Isaac plays this role perfectly, but all the chosen cast members seem to have sworn not to share anything about their wives or girlfriends on social media because Isaac follows this too. He shares many different photos and videos and you can see he is a skilled photographer, but he has no pictures of a potential lover, so I'm going to assume he's not dating anyone. You might easily say, you talked about Simon Peter, but what about Eden? They played a married couple on the show, what about in real life? Well, as opposed to Shahar, Lara Silva is married and has recently had a child. Lara's husband Steve is a football coach and the lucky guy got engaged to Lara four years ago. They got married in 2021 and had their first child last November. So when Lara was on the chosen season 4 set, she was already pregnant. I also want to mention George Zantes, who is, I know, one of your favorite cast members. George has shared various pictures on his Instagram with a young lady, but he doesn't tag her, so she's a little mysterious. They have a wedding picture together, so this answers the question of whether George is taken or not. I wish them a long and healthy marriage. Giovanni Cairo, who plays Thaddeus, is also in a happy relationship with someone you might actually know. He's dating Bella Michaels, the news anchor and reporter. Bella even had an interview with Dallas Jenkins back in 2022. I wonder how she and Giovanni met. They look cute, don't they? Let me now return to a female cast member, Elizabeth Tabish, for example. She portrays Mary Magdalene, one of Jesus' most famous followers. I'm lucky because Elizabeth did not make me work hard. The latest post on her Instagram is a picture of her with her husband, Stan Mayer, on the chosen season 4 premiere. It turns out April 3 was their wedding anniversary. How cute is that? And you can see that they like to share their experiences on social media. Here, the couple is in Disneyland enjoying a fun trip. Here's a boomerang from last year when Elizabeth wished her husband a happy birthday. Overall, it is safe to say that she's in a happy marriage. Let's finish the video with another married couple. This time, I will show you another disciple, Andrew, Simon's brother. Noah James plays the character so well and I'm pleased to see he's also in a loving marriage. James had a wedding ceremony in September 2022. He married 
Norma Jean Marie, and they looked so happy together on that special day. They keep posting each other's pictures on social media, and I love it. That's all about the real life partners of the chosen season forecast. If you want me to come back with part two of this video, comment down below. Who would you like me to focus on next? By the way, I have tons of videos on the chosen cast, their religions in real life, or their funny moments on the chosen season four set. Be sure to watch them. Don't forget to like and share this video. Subscribe to my channel to see more videos about the chosen. See you soon.